Ash Wednesday marks the beginning of the Lenten season, and because of the COVID-19 pandemic, local churches had to come up with different ways to mark the start. At St. Michael's Catholic Church, they were limited to the amount of people that they were allowed inside the church, and two of the three services could be viewed online. Obviously the numbers are down, and obviously uh, I have to wear a mask when I'm uh, celebrating the uh, the mask, but also in distribution of ashes, everyone's wearing masks. It's just, uh, it's kind of like uh, the invisible parishioner. They're not, you can see their eyes, but you can't really see what they, how they feel or if they're reacting to things. It's kind of an interesting time. But at the same time, um, it's, a, it's a start of Lent. We have to start the season and this is the way we do it with ashes on Ash Wednesday and it's a, it's a tremendous gift. Just down the road, the Trinity Lutheran Church offered ashes to go in a container that people could have picked up any time during the week and then watched the service online. I think the pandemic has driven us to be closer in contact and communication, both telephone and computer, and the desire to be together. Uh, is stronger than ever. Rector Mary Linquist of St. Michael's Episcopal Church said people could use dirt or ashes from the wood stove to help mark the sign of the cross on the forehead if they weren't able to get ashes. Uh, Lent is different in that I feel like we've already been in Lent for a whole year because we've given up so much. So instead of emphasizing so much our mortality and our sin, I'm really feeling more called to Remember that we are connected through God's earth. We're connected to the earth and to one another through the symbolism of the ashes.